welcome back guys uh, we are talking about the CSI net suggestions and again in this video we'll be talking about the plant biology chapter for CSI net and the questions or the topics we need to understand from plant biology you know plant biology or botany kind of same thing here and they are going to ask you some questions in different years actually it depends on which year they're going to ask more from botany or not but uh, it is important because they will ask some question now majorly the most important part of botany uh, for CSI net is photosynthesis and uh, all about the photosynthesis so no pickiness in the photosynthesis will be entertained everything learn about photosynthesis majorly you should learn about you know C3 C4 plants and the CAM pathway or the CAM plants these are the plants and these are the different schemes of photosynthesis if you remember so these are the things you need to learn first very well and obviously electron flow electron flow in the photosynthesis of an you know, oxygenic photosynthesis that's very very important now second part is the nitrogen metabolism in plants as well as the different section of uh, the plant nitrogen metabolism purpose and also nitrogen fixation denitrification nitrification all these things this is the part which is very very important for for plants so this is a new part but it is important third one is the plant hormones and in this case you need to learn the examples and you need to know, learn the sources and functions of those hormones and not only these things but also you need to understand the sequential release of those hormones in the development of a plant and how those hormones are actually released and what are their effect that is ultimately shown now fourth one is a phytochrome and flowering of the plant right so in this case phytochrome means you know normally phytochrome is a chemical which is secreted which controls the flowering of the plant depending upon the type of uh, uh, depending upon the amount of light they receive throughout the day right so you can find all these videos videos about all these topics in my youtube channel just click on the link that is presented here in the bottom and you can you will be redirected to the playlist that are having that now phytochromes and flowering you know flowering and different examples of flowering of the plants like long day plants short day plants or something like that right and also you need to understand the structure of phytochrome and how phytochrome occurs and especially about the two forms of phytochrome which is a uh, red form which is phytochrome red and phytochrome far red or FR and PFR right PR and PFR right so these are the two types so these are the major things that you need to understand about the plant biology more uh, and also uh, certain things about you know plant morphology is not that much important but uh, you know tissue culture that's a part of it I have talked it before uh, in the biotechnics section but also tissue culture obviously plant tissue culture plant tissue culture is very very important and you need to learn uh, the basics of plant tissue culture and organizing concept and also you know agrobacterium medi mediated transformation and all these processes because they are also related with plant sections so these are the things which are very very important for you to understand for CSI net that's it